squaring up against uh, John Q. Kim at the tip off. And uh, Kim does get the better of Davis there. Mentioned uh, one of the key performers in this tournament so far, and he will have this shot for three, which is good. Towards uh, Hisan Chu. Davis for three. Yes, this time it is good. Chen Chu for Davis. Chinese Taipei struggled to put this away, and South Korea breaking down the court. The uh, foul is called. Be two from the line here for the Koreans. Not all wrong. Still Korea who lead by one. Here is Davis though. Puts it away. Easy finish. And Ma Hu goes for three. Gets it. Korea looking to respond here with the Lee. Yun Lee and uh, it's a nice pass as well. Yuan Chiang now. Another three attempted, another good one as well. And, uh, the foul is called. It's Po Chen Chu. Chung Yun Lee. Quick passing here. The three is good from Il Yong Keo. Chung Yun Lee. And again, goes for three, gets it. His second for Jun Yun Lee. Open the scoring as Davis at the other end slams it down. Lost it here. This was uh, quite the right one from Yi Xiang Chu. Shot away, Chang passes it inside. First quarter. Still Long Mao Hu. Gets it out to the corner. Oh, nice pass inside and the foul as well. Hey. Tewe Lee in the first quarter. Of the first quarter. That's the difference here, and they do get it away in time. First quarter. Lucy Davis averaging nearly 19 points a game. Lucy Davis averaging nearly 19 points a game. Chinese Taipei almost took him to the end of the first quarter. As Lee responds with a simple two of his own. Lost it. And away comes South Korea. Fast break. Almost to nothing, but the foul is called. Nicely put away. South Korea failed to make it count this time. This time, Pei. Looking for Davis. Easy. The big man slams it down to move into double digits. South Korea going on to play in the final, losing to Qatar as a break here. Min Cho will. Sun Hyun Lee, nice little handoff there. Sean goes inside, the foul is called. Jung Kyu Kim drawing it. He does. Almost stolen there by Chiang. Sun Hyun Kim, look at the open space there. 
So much time there, Yi Sang Chiu. Ho Chen Chu makes it. Three for him. Doubles his tally for the afternoon. Six points to his name now. As, uh, South Korea respond again. Taken instead by uh, Jong Kyu Kim. And now South Korea lead. Three attempted there. That was really good play from South Korea. Il Yong Kyo. Lee Sang Chu. Lee back into Chu again. Lee Sang Chu. No problem. Two minutes left in the first half. Pass inside's a good one. Foul is called. By Buk Young Choi. And Davis intercepts and should come away with something here. The foul is called. This is his uh, opportunity. Whistle has gone again. Lee Davis. It was a poor pass from Lee. And the break is on. This should be an easy two. It is. To the half time interval with a three point lead or more if they can produce something here. And they will get a bigger lead. The foul is called as well. Three-point play. Chinese Taipei have just under five seconds to uh, try something in the uh, closing moments here. Davis gets it. Well, that's a bonus for Chinese Taipei. It's only a four-point lead for... South Korea, thanks to that late two from Quincy Davis, who moves on to 14 points for the game. He could still have a very big say. South Koreans pass inside, but stolen by Chinese Taipei in the breakaway. Davis is waiting if needed. He isn't needed. And it's two for He Sancho. Two, which is immediately cancelled out. Simple dunk. Really good play by John Q. Kim. He's been excellent defensively. Chinese Taipei had extended their lead to seven and were starting to look pretty impressive as uh, Davis puts it away and draws the foul. by four at the end of the uh, second quarter as the South Koreans get themselves back in front. Jong Kyu Kim slams it down. Who unable to find Davis and it's going to be a simple two at the other end. To that at the end of the uh, second quarter. It could have been worse had Davis not hit that two right on the buzzer. This is uh, Po Chen Cho. towards Davis who puts it away no problem at all become the first of these two teams to hit the 50 point mark and to go in front once again Lee gets the pass out to Cho who uh, gets his shot away and scores very short with that uh, effort it's just it completely and it's nicely done it's Davis no mistake. Chen Cho, nice pass inside and up and in. Pei. Eight point turnaround since the half time interval, but here's the three, which is good. Found. So Korea get themselves in front. Who? Chen Cho. 
Superb. It's Kim. Oh, he's unchallenged. Made that look easy there. He sang Chu. Puts it out to Po Chen Chu, who puts it in. This is Song Jin Lee. And, uh, plenty of space and time. On a regular basis out here. Po Chen Chu uh, losing possession. And uh, South Korea could increase their advantage here. It's an easy put away for Song Hyun Lee. Ho Chien Cho. Still Po Chien Cho. Tries again. And this time he does make Hoon Hyo. He's inside. The three is good this time. And South Korea have a five-point lead. Oh, it was just inside. I thought he'd uh, made it from outside, but just the two points. Here's Chang. That's from outside, and that is good. Chu gets it, and they are in front. Chinese Taipei lead by one. Here's Chang. A cool head at the moment. It's uh, South Korea. This is going to be a vital play now. In it goes. And the foul is called. Getting himself here. And put his team in front. Throws it in. This is Chu. Goes in and scores. Well, they managed to get themselves in front. There is still time. Kingan Lee. The foul is called. They will go. Quincy Davis, who can do nothing but sit and watch here. And it is the lead for South Korea. One final attempt, maybe, for Chinese Taipei, who missed the shot. And the victory goes to the South Koreans. Just a single point in it at the end. They couldn't score in those final four seconds. And Chinese Taipei for this quarterfinal. A thrilling encounter, a fascinating end to the contest. And South Korea are the first team into the semi-finals.